Hi, I'm Jim Henderson from SKF. Today I'm here to introduce the SKF spindle nut. It consists of a forged precision machine nut and a bolt assembly with a lock washer. Together these pieces will provide the user with one of the most robust options in the market today. The SKF spindle nut is available for steer, drive, and trailer axles. It's easy to use and requires absolutely no special tools for installation. Now let's just take a look and see how easy this is to install. Locate the keyway in the axle. You'll notice that the lock washer has its own tab that will match with that keyway. So I'll align them, push the washer on all the way till it pushes up against the external wheel bearing. Now it's fully seated. Now you've got your nut and bolt assembly. It too has a locking slot on it, which you can see. So you turn the nut over. Make sure the locking bolts don't protrude past flush. So this nut's free spinning. Let's start the threads, spin it down by hand, all the way. Now we've got it seated by hand. So you take a thin wall socket and a calibrated torque wrench and torque it to 200 foot-pounds. Once you've torqued to 200 foot-pounds, the hub and drum will not spin. Now take your wrench again and back the nut off one full turn. Now the hub and drum should spin freely. So give it a couple of rotations. Now give it 50 foot-pounds of torque. Spin it again. Make sure that it's still free spinning. Now back it off one quarter turn. Now you look to see if the flange slot matches with a washer slot. In this case you can see there's a tooth alignment. You don't want a tooth alignment, you want a slot alignment. Advance the nut to the clockwise to the next washer slot. Once they align, as you can see here, you'll be able to drive the hex cap screws using a hand tool. Drive both the lock bolts until they're fully seated and tightened. Here you can see a side view of the bolt going through the washer and fully seating. Tighten them up using a torque wrench for the instruction sheet. Now your assembly is complete. Okay, see how simple that was? And don't forget to check the in-play for TMC RP618. Remember, when choosing replacement parts for your fleet, don't compromise safety. Install confidence with SKF. Thank you.